A new cafe and juice bar at Pacoima City Hall could provide the economic jolt the area needs. As Gil Reyes reports, art, tourism and fresh produce are all part of the recipe. Cafe O Muerte coffee shop and Fruta y Cultura juice bar. Both just opened, both expected to give Pacoima a much needed energy boost. We're doing it with local produce being uh, grown by our neighbors. This ribbon cutting, more than just a celebration of two new businesses opening up, but also what Councilman Felipe Fuentes calls social enterprise. A customer who comes and enjoys a simple cup of coffee doesn't realize that the money spent on this is attacking a lot of policy challenges in our community. Problems like unemployment, lack of healthy food options, and the absence of a true arts and cultural hub in Pacoima. But that may be changing. Over a cup of joe, Councilman Fuentes reveals that many of the young people behind the counter are from the Youth Policy Institute, working students earning money for college. Both businesses are also just steps away from a new open-air museum. It's expected to house a revolving door of art themes year-round. The hope is visiting art lovers with money to spend will also love juice and coffee. We had uh, the second annual Day of the Dead Festival in November that got a lot of attention. The juice bar also buys its produce fresh from local growers Eldwin and Noemi Herrera. And now we volunteer and, and we right. go help other families yeah. Yeah. put on their own beds and grow their food. Right? I mean, it's mind-blowing, right? I mean, we grew up in the city and men taught us how to grow our own food and now we're doing it and now we're going to provide it for our community. It's exciting. And make money. And make yeah, money. And make we're money. exciting. <laughs> so come get a taste of the new Van Nuys Boulevard in Pacoima. Celebrate the art, celebrate a great street and a great cup of coffee. How was the coffee? Bar? Cacao latte. Delicious. <laughs> For LA This Week, I'm Gil Reyes. Cyclists are invited to stop by when Ciclavia rolls through Pacoima in March.